The five richest people in the world, billionaires play a key role in helping influence the world, from political decisions to social and economic reforms. Forbes puts the list of billionaires in the world at 2,755. However, only a handful, 10 to be exact, currently have $100 billion or more in net worth each. Many of these billionaires are founders of technology companies, with much of their wealth wrapped up in the companies they started. Below are the 10 individuals currently considered the wealthiest at the time, once Elon Musk has had his hands in several different companies over the years. Originally enrolled at Stanford University, Musk deferred his attendance to launch Zip2, one of the earliest online navigation services. A portion of the proceeds from this endeavor was then reinvested to create X.com, an online payment system that later became PayPal. While both of these systems were eventually sold to other companies, Musk has maintained his status as CEO and lead designer of his third project, Space Exploration Technologies (SpaceX), which aims to make space exploration more affordable. In 2016, Musk founded two more companies, Neuralink and The Boring Company with him serving as the CEO of the former. Neuralink is developing brain-machine interface devices to help individuals suffering from paralysis and potentially allow users to mentally interact with their computers and mobile devices, too. Jeff Bezos, in 1994, Jeff Bezos founded Amazon. Calm in a garage in Seattle, shortly after he resigned from the hedge fund giant D.E. Shaw. He had originally pitched the idea of an online bookstore to his former boss David E. Shaw, who wasn't interested, Bezos originally took Amazon public in 1997 and went on to become the first man since Bill Gates in 1999 to achieve a net worth of more than $100 billion. Bezos's other projects include aerospace company Blue Origin, The Washington Post, which he purchased in 2013. 5. Mark Zuckerberg, Mark Zuckerberg first developed Facebook, now Meta, alongside fellow students Eduardo Saverin, Dustin Moskovitz, and Chris Hughes while attending Harvard University in 2004. As Facebook began to be used at other universities, Zuckerberg dropped out of Harvard to focus entirely on his growing business. Today, Zuckerberg is the CEO and chair of Meta which had more than 2.9 billion monthly active users as of Q3 2021. Facebook is the world's largest social networking service, enabling its users to create a personal profile, connect with friends and family, join or create groups, and much more. As the website is free to use, most of the company's revenue is generated through advertising, we are providing the best luxury videos for you. So subscribe to our channel to get updated and also press the bell icon to get notify about latest videos and the 10,000 year clock, also known as the long now, on July 20th, 2021, Bezos, his brother Mark, aviation pioneer Wally Funk, and Dutch student Oliver Damon completed Blue Origin's first successful crewed flight, reaching an altitude of just above 62 miles before landing safely. Three. Bernard Arnault, French national Bernard Arnault is the chair and CEO of LVMH, the world's largest luxury goods company. This business owns some of the biggest brands on earth, including Louis Vuitton, Hennessy, Marc Jacobs, and Sephora, an engineer by training, Arnault's business chops became apparent while working for his father's construction firm, Ferret Savinal, which he would take control of in 1971. He later converted Ferret Savinal to a real estate company named Farinell Inc. 4. Bill Gates While attending Harvard University in 1975, Bill Gates went to work alongside his childhood friend Paul Allen to develop new software for the original microcomputers. Following this project's success, Gates dropped out of Harvard during his junior year and went on to found Microsoft with Allen. In addition to being the largest software company in the world, Microsoft also produces its line of personal computers, publishes books through Microsoft Press, provides email services through its Exchange server, and sells video game systems and associated peripheral devices. Originally Microsoft's chief software architect, 
Gates later transitioned to the role of chair in 2008. He had joined Berkshire Hathaway's board in 2004. He stepped down from both boards on March 13, 2020.